Good evening, teacher. Hello, Francisco. Francisco Antonio. Hi, how are you? Hello. Oh, nice. Hello, Claudia. Hello, Carlos. Hi, teacher. Hello. Okay, good. So we have Jaime. Hello. I see Selena here too. Edwin. Dalia. Hello. Hello, good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening, Ivan. How was your day, people? Was it good? Nice. Nice. Or terrible? Huh? No, huh? Excellent. Very good. Okay, good, nice. Good. Good. That's the that's the attitude. Okay, that's the attitude, right? That's the attitude. Not to be excellent, good all the time. Okay. Eh, because eh, vi que estuvieron resolviendo algunos problemas ahora en el en el chat con lo de las conexiones y todo todo bien hasta el momento. Sí. Okay, ya todos tienen. Sí, todo bien. Va. Okay, excellent. Because So we have to have this one. Well, we're going to go with the alphabet, remember? Yesterday we were going to, well, we watched a video about the ABC, okay, and practicing all the, all the letters from the alphabet. Like this one, the man is very slow, he doesn't want to open the, the platform. I think all, all the teachers are trying to access, here we are. Okay, so we're going to share uh, the sound. Here we go. Okay, so just three, we cover up to the alphabet. Okay, I'm going to repeat part of the, the video so that you can remember the pronunciation, okay, of some, um, some letters, probably, I don't think you can see this one. Okay. You can see the page in blank, right? Now, the first the four wells that we have, four wells that we have here, these are A. E, I, O, N, U. Okay, this is uh, probably the, a little confusing sometimes, right? confuses a little bit because a, the first one is A, then E and E in Spanish, right? We say A, E, O, U, but in English is A, E, 
Entonces, este, la, la I se confunde con la E, right? Y eso a veces crea alguna confusion, right? Entonces, A, E, I, O, U, U, O, I, E, A, A, E, I, U, O, I, U, and then this is um, una manera de practicarla es eh, alternando, right? The letters, you say, for example, A, I, U, O, E, A, U. Then you say O, U, I, A, E, I, O, E, U, A, and then this is, you know, to to get your your brain, okay, acostumbrar el cerebro a ver la imagen y decir el, nom el nombre de la letra, right? Eh, in English, right? When you say, for example, you see A, you see de la A, you say A, okay? La A, you say E, la E, and you say I, O, O, right? U, then you say la U, U. Then you go thinking that way. Uh, let me see what else. Uh, then you have, for example, B, C, B, F, B, H, uh, J, K, L, M, N, P, Q, R, S, T, C, W, X, Y, and Z. Okay, <clears throat> so I have uh, I have omitted from this group the five vowels, right? A, E, I, O, U. Here you have B, C, D, F, G, H, J, K, L, M, N, P, Q, R, S, T, Z, W, X, Y, and Z. Okay, now you can introduce A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U. Okay, so A, B, they say A, E, I, this one is going to be O, and here you can use U. Okay, so the idea is, you know, to make the brain uh, fly, right? Fly with, with the words. Um, okay, I have here. Who wants to? Who wants to spell? Who wants to spell the name? Your name. Uh, somebody's in the chat. Okay, Claudia, yes. Okay. Who wants to spell the name and say hello? My name is, for example, Luis Avellan. L. I'm going to write it here. Look. Spell your name. Okay, how do you spell your name? Okay, L U. I S A V E and 
L L A N Okay, Luis Avellan. Yes, Carlos. Spell your name. Uh, first and last and last night. That's correct. Uh, C A R L O S and R O D R I J U E Z. Yes, G U. G U. Uh -huh. Okay. I G U. I G. Okay. Very good. Excellent, Carlos. Thank you. Okay. Somebody else? Anybody else? Kima Sarima. Okay, Ivan, go ahead. <clears throat> Eh, no, no veo este, el abecedario. Ah, ok, que lo quité. Uh, déjame ver. Ok, ok, ok. There you go. Ok. A, B, C, D, E. No, but your name. Your name. My name. Yes, spelling your name. I, B. I, B, A, N. Yes. Second. Name, uh -huh. A, A, B, R, A, H, I, M. Okay. My last name, R, A, M, I, R, E, C. Okay. There you go. Thank you very much. Good. Okay. Thank you. Um, I I have someone, hay alguien que dice PC, que había levantado la mano tercero, pero, what's your name? Eh, Patricia de Sánchez. Ok, eh, ponga su nombre porque si le sale PC en Zoom, no la van a identificar, ah, no, le, okay. no le van a dar sus minutos, ok. Ah, vaya, ok, ok, ya veo yo eso, gracias. Okay. Pero ahorita, dígame, eh, deletre su nombre, ok. Ok, ok. G A T R I C I A M A R T I N E C. Patricia Martinez, right? Yes. Okay, good. Then uh, Carlos Cruz. Carlos, spell your name. Carlos tiene la mano arriba. Ya no está. Okay, then Francisco. The name complete. Yes. My name is spell is F R A N C I S. C O A N T O N I O. My last, last name. name spell is C A L D E R O N R I D E R A. Perfect. Thank you very much, Francisco. Okay, Ariel. Spell your name. Okay, Ariel, Ariel Abigail. Tiene el micrófono apagado.
No le enciende ahorita. Ok. Entonces, eh, enciéndelo y cuando ya lo tenga listo, me avisa, ok. Vamos a pasar con Elisa. Elisa Grande. Go ahead. Spell your name. My name is spell C L A O D I A G R A M D P. Claudia. Claudia Grande. Ah, ok. No es que me dice Elisa, pero no, sí, si Claudia. Me... Claudia. Ajá. Este es el más del corto. <risa> no, es ok. Good. So, es Claudia Elisa. Yes. Sí. Ok, good. All right, good. No problem. Eh, Jaime. Uh, my name is Jaime. Yes. Uh, J-A-I-M-E-P-O-N-C-E. -E. Perfect. Claudia Stephanie. My name is C-L-A-U-V-I-A. M E N J I B A R. Ay, tomo ta, tomo tajo. Y que la Stephanie, le faltó Stephanie de Benito. No, it's okay, good. Está bien. Nice. No, porque esta I was expecting the others. Okay. Uh, Ariel, ¿se pudo? No, sí, yet. del teléfono. Ah, ah. Yo estaba viendo ah. la otra imagen, me salió por otro lado. Okay. Ah, okay. Oh. A A R I E L A B I G A I L. Yes. Yes. Okay. Ah, uh, my last is my. Uh, ¿Cómo sería? Spell last name is ah uh, T O R R E S. Eh, a L B A R E C. Very good. Ok, nice. Va que lo puede de memoria. <laughs> Más o menos. Que vi que está viendo para arriba. Good. That's nice. Excellent. Había eh, alguien que había encendido. Ha levantado la mano. Alguien más. Por aquí. Wait. Ah, aquí está Deris. Yes, Deris. Ok, Deris. Hi. My name spell is D E R I S. And my last name is M I R A M M D A. In Panameño? P A M A M I M O. La ñ sería como N. Ok, como M. N, Ajá, porque no existe en inglés, sería panameno, right, something like that. Yes, ok, good. Eh, Cecilia. Hello, teacher. Hello. My name is Cecilia. C-E-C-I-L-I-A. B-E-L-A-S-Q. Q, E, Z. Very good. Okay, nice. Okay. Uh, we're going to just here. Okay, this one. Okay, we have these five words, and then we have, um, uh, let me see now, we're going to take Claudia da Dalia. Dalia, eh, deletreme las palabras rojas. Okay, Dalia, go ahead. Un 
cardio. Uh, Claudia Stephanie. Levantó la mano. Sí. Lo hago yo. Yes, no, no. Dele. Bien. Eh, B O O K. Okay. C A R. C A R. Okay, so then. Hoy le vamos a agregar algo. Cuando diga B, repeat, you say B O O K, book. C A R, car. Okay, repeat okay. again. Uh, B O O K book. Okay. C A R car. Car. Excellent. Okay. Uh, Elsa Karina. Sí, teacher. Okay. Las the las blue words. Las que están en azul. Bien. Uh, w O R K word. Yes. S H E E T. Sheet. Sheet. Okay, sheet. Sheet. Good. Nice. Uh, Alison. Alison Michelle. Las Negras, right? The black words. C O M for. Air. Um, yes. O M. T A B L E Comfortable. Comfortable. S T U D Y Study. The study. Okay, very good. Nice. Uh, let me see what uh, who else, who else, who else we have. Claudia Esmeralda. Yes, Claudia Esmeralda. You read red and blue. Hello. B O O K book. C A R car. Continue. Blue. Uh, y W. O W O W O R K work work H E E T sheet sheet okay excellent okay now we have... <laughs> okay no problem uh, Carolina Rivera the black words. C O M of R R T A P L I E comfortable B yes comfortable S T U D. Mm -hmm. Why? Why study? Okay, study. Okay, so the number one is study. Book. Uh -huh. Book. We have book, car, work, sheet, comfortable, study. Study, right? S D U D Y. S C O M F O R T A B L E comfortable. Okay, Emperatriz. The todas the six words. Okay. Yes, all of them. B O O K book. C A Yes, sheet. Uh -huh. C O M F O R T A B L E comfortable. Okay. 
That's it. Why? Okay, okay, study. Okay, that's the word study. Okay, people. And uh, here are Cecilia Alvarenga. Hi, okay. Cecilia, yes, hello. Cecilia La Rojas, Jacqueline, usted va a leer las azules. And quiero una vez más. Y Brian Antonio, las negras. Okay, Cecilia. B O O K book. C A R car. Okay. Azules. Um, el, el micrófono ¿Quién me puede ahorita? Who's next? Oh, Jacqueline Okay, Jacqueline um, Hi, teacher Hello Hello este, uh, Blue Yes, the blue words ah, The blue W O R Q K Work K Perdón K Work Yes 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 H E E D Sheet. Sheet. Largo. Sheet. 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 Okay. Sheet. Sheet. Okay. Sheet. Good. Good. Thank you. Brian? Color black, true? Yes, sir, Brian. Uh, comfortable. C O M F O T A B L E. Study. S T U D Y. S T U D Y. Very good. Ok, eh, si hay alguien más que quiera practicar que se me haya escapado, Cecilia, eh, Héctor, Héctor, Here. Héctor, the eh, black ones. C-O-M-F-O-R-T-A-B-L-A. Um, e. E, excuse me. S T U D Y. Okay, study. Very good. Thank you. Edwin, the blue ones. Edwin Eduardo, because we have two Edwins. Hello, teacher. Hello. Uh, blue, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, w O R K, work. S H E E. Okay, that's uh, sheet. 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 Okay. Sheet. Edwin Edgardo, the red ones. B O O K book. C A R car. Okay, that's the car. Good. Eh, quiero ver alguien que no. Patricia sí estuvo, ¿verdad? Creo que. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Ah, que ya puse el nombre. Yes. Abiel, Abiel Elion. ¿Qué es? Abiel. Yes. Ok. <coughs> the blue ones. Dígame las blue, the blue, the blue. W O R K. Work. S H E E T. Shit. Shit. Ok, nice. Eh, Carolina ya, ya participó. Rivera. Yes. Yes, ok. Eh, Hilda. Hilda no, ¿verdad? Hilda no Norma. No. Um, the, the blue ones. The blue. Uh, w O R Okay. Uh, work. S 
H E E T. Cheese. Cheese. Okay, good. Nice. And the other one is. Ah, Carlos, Carlos Cruz. No le funcionó el micrófono. Ahora creo que sí. The blunt ones. Carlos. Carlos. No. Ok, creí que se había conectado con dos. Ok, si no, lo pone en el chat si tiene algún problem. Quiero ver. Ya me haría. No problem, bien. Ok, no me funciona. Ok, yes, Carlos. Ok, entiendo. No problem. Yes, it happens. Si sí, es que ya vi que tenía dos conexiones, creí que él estaba funcionando. Ok, no problem. Don't worry. Ok, good. Eh, bueno, si ya me queda alguien ahorita, en la siguiente levante la mano primero para que tengamos otra participación, ok? Good. Now we're going to... Eh, let me... Have this one. Let me go back to the book. And then... Okay, the video, listen to the pronunciation. It's recording at this time. Once you're finished recording, you click stop. And English, English, English. To see the English alphabet. I would like for you to listen to me and observe the way I move my lips and my mouth for each letter. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, D, W, X, Y, Z. Now, I would like for you to listen to a quick audio program and repeat. It's recommended that you practice as many times as necessary, 10 at least, and make sure that you are pronouncing correctly. Listen and practice. A, B, C, D, E, F. G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Now, what I would like for you to do is to practice expressing your name and spell it out. For example, my name is Joe. That's J-O-E. Now, let me go ahead and write that. Uh, my name is Joe. And we're going to spell it out. That's J O E. 
my last name is science okay and let me go ahead and spell it out that's s a e n z spell the names of at least 10 folks for example your children wife parents etc I'll give a quick example of that my daughter's name is Allison that's a L L I S O N and record yourself on the following website bookroo.com after that you should save it and share the link on the discussion forums the idea is to get feedback from the instructor and your peers let me show you uh, how that website works if you go to this website bookroo.com I'm gonna go ahead and put that on the new window here a new tab um, you will see the website uh, you should click on this icon that says click to record well this one you already we already watched last night probaron con ese sitio web nadie probó como funciona todavía no teacher hasta mañana me voy a ingresar a ese aquí bien aquí solo tienen que poner bookaroo Es el primero que está acá. Right. Ahí está. Entonces, así es, así es, así como les apare, me apareció aquí, les va a aparecer a ustedes. Le dan clic y comienza la grabación. Right. You can start. Hello, my name is Luis Avellan. L-U-I-S. My last name is A-V-E-L-L-A-N. Then stop. And here says, eh, guardar y compartir, right? Y aquí están las opciones. Pueden copiar este link, right? Y ya lo copian. Lo voy a poner aquí en el chat. Okay, denle click a ese link. Y van a escuchar lo que acabo de estar hablando. ¿Se funciona? Yes. Ok, entonces, y así es como funciona. Eso bien sencillo. Ahora, pueden también descargarlo. Aquí dice descargar, ustedes lo descargan y ven ahí ya lo descargó a mi, a mi computadora. Disco, right? Y aquí ya lo puedo escuchar. Y ahí puedo andarlo escuchando. Ok. That's it. En, ahora, si ustedes le dan aquí borrar, ok, dice borrar este audio, lo que va a suceder es que ya, si le dan clic ahorita al link que les envié, ya no van a poder escuchar, ok, entonces ya les va a aparecer como que, que no se encuentra, ok, ya se borró. Y, este, y si lo dejan ahí, dentro de unos, tal vez, 15, 20 días, eh, automáticamente lo va a borrar la página, porque como hay mucha gente que lo utiliza y es gratis, eh, entonces ya, ya no va a estar, ¿verdad? Entonces, eso es, digamos, la, cómo funciona. Eh, entonces, ustedes lo pueden bajar, pegar en algún lugar y tenerlo ahí, siempre va a estar en la web.
si lo quieren bajar a su disco duro, andarlo en su teléfono o algo, el sonido, ahí lo tienen. En la, solo lo bajan y ya baja a su computadora o a su, o a su teléfono. ¿Ok? Bien sencillo, no es eh, complicado de usar, right Entonces, ¿qué pueden hacer ahí? Practicar eh, deletreando su nombre y luego escucharse. ¿Ok? Eh, pueden deletrear eh, los nombres de todos los miembros de su familia, right? Eh, como dice aquí, my daughter's name is Allison. That's A-L-L-I-S-O-N. And there you go. Eh, palabras como las que yo escribí, also, you can also do it that way. Ok. Eh, S. No es solamente para que lo hagan. O. You go ahead. And um, after you share this link, after that you should. La idea es que lo hagan cuando, cuando también tienen el tiempito, están relajados, okay, para que se tomen su, su tiempo para hacer. Ok. Now the next one. We're going to have listen to five conversations and check the correct answer for each instruction, right? For each one. Then five conversations and check the correct answer for each. De las cinco conversaciones que van a utilizar, de van a escuchar, perdón, van a ver si está deletreando John o John. ¿Cuál de los dos? Sara o Sara. Ok. Recuerden que los nombres es, eh, tanto en español como en inglés se deletrean a veces se escriben de diferentes formas Stephen Stephen Catherine Catherine okay these are four and five okay vamos a escucharlo and see what happens okay how do you spell the names Listen and check the correct answers. One. Your name is John Lee? That's right. And how do you spell your first name, Mr. Lee? It's J-O-N. Okay, thank you. Two. Sarah Brown. Your first name is spelled S-A-R-A-H? No. My name is spelled S-A-R-A. -A. I'm sorry, could you repeat that? Yes, it's S-A-R-A. -A. Got it, thanks. Three. My name is Stephen Jones. Thank you. Stephen, that's S-T-E-V. No, it's spelled S-T-E-P-H-E-N. Oh, excuse me. S-T-E-P-H-E-N. That's right. Four. Your name, please. It's Catherine Simpson. Is that K-A-T-H-E-R-I-N-E? -E? No, it's K-A-T-H-R-Y-N. Oh, so it's K-A-T-H-R-Y-M. Thank you, Ms. Simpson. Five. And what's your first name, please? It's Chris. Is your name spelled C-H-R-I-S? No, it's spelled K-R-I-S. Chris with a K. Chris with a K. Thanks. Okay. Una vez más para que vayan a confirmar si estaban en lo correcto en alguna. Y luego hacemos la, la revisión. Wait a minute. This one. It's loading. Yeah. How do you spell the names? Listen and check the... Yes, Patricia. Sir. Uh huh. 
Eh, fíjese de que la 4 y la 5 no, no logré verlas. No sé si usted no bajó la pantalla o, o solo, o no sé si es mi computadora la del problema. No, no la bajé por, ajá, por, por cómo es que se llama, para que la volvieran a escuchar. Ahorita la vamos a poner en esta. Voy a volverlos a poner y van. Ah, ok. Ok. Thank you. Ok. Correct answers. One. Your name is John Lee? That's right. And how do you spell your first name, Mr. Lee? It's J-O-N. Okay, thank you. Two. Sarah Brown. Your first name is spelled S-A-R-A-H? No, my name is spelled S-A-R-A. I'm sorry, could you repeat that? Yes, it's S-A-R-A. -A. Got it. Thanks. Three. My name is Stephen Jones. Thank you. Stephen. That's S-T-E-V. No, it's spelled S-T-E-P-H-E-N. Oh, excuse me. S-T-E-P-H-E-N. That's right. Four. Your name, please. It's Catherine Simpson. Is that K-A-T-H-E-R-I-N-E? -E? No, it's K-A-T-H-R-Y-N. Oh, so it's K-A-T-H-R-Y-N. Thank you, Ms. Simpson. Five. And what's your first name, please? It's Chris. Is your name spelled C-H-R-I-S? No, it's spelled K-R-I-S. Chris with a K. Chris with a K. Thanks. Chris with a K. Okay, you got them? Uh, yes. Yes? Okay. Yes. Good. So we're going to check. The correct answers, just um, let me check on this. Ready? Okay. Um, what is the first one? We have J O N or J O N H. This first or second? First, first option. The first? J first option. First option. Yes. Good. J O N. Good. And the number two? S A R is A R A H. First option. First option. First option. First option, first option two. Okay. Sarah. Oh. All right. Number three. S T E V E N. S T. Second option. H. Second option. Option two. Second, second two. option. Okay, so option two. Okay, how about the next one? A Catherine or Catherine. K A T H E R I N E. Option two. Option two. All right. The correct. Right. The, and number five. It's they the first are... option. I S Grace. This one? Yes. Option one. Yes. 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 Okay. Yes. Okay, sure. The Sure. Yes. Sure. Yes, yes. 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 Good. For sure. Como que mañana es sábado. Eh, 
o miércoles. Yo no me acuerdo. Okay, no, no, no. Yes. Wednesday. Okay, good. So Wednesday. let's submit it. And okay, one is correct. Number five. Number four is correct. Number three. Number two. Number one. Okay, good people. Everything. Excellent. Everything correct. Yes. Good job. Okay, good job. Nice. Congratulations for everybody. Then, okay. Ah, if you see the progress check. Okay, good. Now, this is the progress. Now let's go back to the course. And this is the section. It's loading. Slow. Slow motion. Okay, so that's the spelling names. Now the next one is, by the end of this class, you will learn how to form statements and questions using the verb to be. Okay, ahorita vamos subiendo un poquito más. Ahora vamos a ver oraciones y preguntas con el verbo to be. Hi everyone. In this class you'll learn how to form statements and questions using the verb to be. Let's get started by looking at the image on your screen. I would like to start by explaining the verb to be which corresponds to each pronoun. As you can see, towards the left hand side of the chart you can see the pronoun I that will be equals to M for the pronouns you we and they you're going to use are and for the pronouns he she and it then uh, we're going to use is so um, if we look at the examples I'm Jennifer Miller this is the same thing as saying I am Jennifer Miller you can see the meaning of those contractions towards the right, right hand side of the screen now let's try to make sense of this by looking at the examples on the chart. I'm Jennifer Miller. You're in my class. She's in our class. Jennifer is in our class. He's over there. Steven is over there. It's my math book. It's Miller. My last name is Miller. In order to understand this, you need to follow this particular rule that I'm going to display here um, on this document. Let me just change the size. One second. All right. Uh, and we're going to try to make sense of it, right? The subject uh, or pronoun is the first thing that we're going to have in order to form sentences. So, for example, I is a subject. And as we saw here, we can see that the verb to be to use whenever we use the pronoun or the subject I will be am. I am and the complement is just other words that are used so for example I am Joe so we got a subject the verb to be and then some kind of complement uh, let's give a, another example I uh, the verb to be I am and what is the complement to that? I'm going to say an English teacher. Okay, let me give another example. Uh, now I'm going to um, give an example with he. He is the subject of our sentence. Uh, and um, if you remember uh, for that, we're going to use the verb to be is. He 
is, and we're going to say uh, Mario, that's his name, um, he, then we're going to say he is um, a mechanic. He is at work. Uh, let me go ahead and give an example with the pronoun they uh, and they are my co-workers. Now let's learn how to form yes or no questions using the verb to be. Let's look at this example that, that you see here on this chart. Now let's learn my co-workers. Okay, wait, I just, well, I want to stop here. my co-workers okay now if you see this one the bird to be is what el verbo to be is ser o estar okay ser o estar cuál es el, lo ser o estar eh, en español obviamente tenemos las dos formas ¿verdad? ser decimos yo soy yo soy maestro okay yo soy profesor de inglés eh, él es un doctor, él es un ingeniero, él es un eh, mecánico, él es un, eh, ¿qué más? Él es un, eh, help me, help me, driver, es un conductor, okay, él es un chef, él es un cocinero, él es una cocinera, él es un, un ingeniero, una doctora, una secretaria, ok, es, 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 right? Entonces, ahí se usa el mismo es. Pero yo digo, yo estoy en mi casa. Ahí ya no estoy hablando de ser, sino que de estar. Pero es el mismo verbo. I am, I am a teacher. I am in my house. Okay? And when you say, for example, the, uh, I am a doctor. Soy doctor. I am at the hospital. Estoy en el hospital. Okay? Uh, I am a secretary. Okay, so I'm secretary, so I'm secretary. I am in the office. Okay, estoy en la oficina. Uno es estar o ser. Entonces, esa diferencia hay que lograr que, que entre, right, de una manera que la podamos manipular y utilizar en cuando queramos decir soy o cuando decimos estoy, cuando decimos él es o él está. Okay. No problem. En los ejemplos, porque me, en los que me detuve, si ven, el primero dice, I am Joe, soy, right? I am an English teacher, soy. He is Mario, es. He is a mechanic, es. He is at work, aquí ya cambia, él está en el trabajo, ¿ok? They are my co-workers, son. Y si ven en la estábamos no que se ve muy pequeña no sé si van a poder verla dice I am Jennifer Miller okay yo soy Jennifer Miller you are in my class tú estás en mi clase eh, she's in our class okay está en nuestra clase Jennifer is in our class then uh, over there Steven is over there, ok, uh, eso es, digamos, lo que hay que ver, ser o estar, eh, nos vamos a quedar aquí hoy porque ya tengo la next call, la siguiente llamada, y este, estoy en esta parte, vamos a practicar mañana la, las oraciones afirmativas, y luego vamos a pasar a ver las formas interrogativas, para que nos vaya quedando claro, una vez, ¿verdad? Okay, people. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Bye, teacher. Bye, teacher. Bye, teacher. Bye, teacher. Bye. Bye. Thank, thank you. you.
you.